I am Walton County Commissioner, District 5, Cindy Meadows, and uh, this is Grayton Beach State Park, and we are all here today to see the deployment of the first artificial reef that will be provided for our tourists and our residents and our locals and our guests to add uh, snorkeling to our list of activities. So we're very excited about this. We want to thank uh, the South Walton Reef Association. They have they have pioneered this and piloted it. This is just a commun another community effort between the public-private partnership that is um, that is going to benefit everyone. Everybody, if you take a look right now, they're getting ready to drill one in. So what? The, uh, so what you've got is the board, and then there's a hydraulic jet, that green hose, that hooks to the top of the pylon. And as soon as they get it in location, they set it down on the bottom, turn on the thing, and it jets the sand out of the way and sinks the reef down to the bottom. They'll leave about a foot, or, a foot to three feet above that, that, that last plate between that and the bottom. And then you can see the gaps, and here it goes. It's... So there will be 58 of those towers in totality. Well, it's a dream come true. I mean, we've been working on this for over two years, and the uh, the community's gotten behind it so well, and it's just the support's been overwhelming. And without the funding from private and government sources, we wouldn't be here today looking at this barge about to drill in another tower. So it's pretty fantastic. We have been back and forth from it, and. We can take some VIPs out there to uh, get an up close and personal look at it. WaltonReefs.org, and you can also check us out on the Facebook page at South Walton Artificial Reef Association. You're welcome.